Oh. Someone told the brother that the Killzone 3 beta is now out for Eastern Time. Before it was just for the UK. Let me turn on my PS3 like so. Okay. But yeah, uh, I was just watching a YouTube video and someone said, It's now out for Eastern Time. It's now out. So I was rushing. PS3 is loading up. You know, I hope this is not a trick. I hope I don't log on and it's still not out. And I didn't really, really want to make a UK account. I didn't want to go through all that stuff. So, um, let's go to my friends list. Let's see uh, if anyone's. Oh yeah, someone's playing that kill. <gasps> okay. <laughs> PlayStation Store. Let's see where I can um new releases. There it is. I see it. And it says already down. What the heck? How did I download it already? <laughs> I don't even have it. Anyways. Downloading background. So yeah, guys. Kills on 3 open beta is out. If you don't know. <laughs> well, now you do. Okay, uh, so download like so. I'm doing this with one hand. So um, anyways, the review will come after this scene right here. Let me just go to download management. 3% downloading. Okay, so after this part, I'll do my review on this whole thing. I'm just scrolling through on this video, and a lot of people are pissed. You know, I, I, I might as well talk while it's downloading. A lot of people are pissed because IGN uh, reviewed Kills Kills on 3 and gave it a 8.5. <laughs> Oh my god, um, and you know how they always say IGN stands for ignorance. You can't spell ignorance without the IGN. <laughs> That's what they always do. You know, I mean, they're reviewers. Their job is to review games. Uh, if it's not what you think it should get, I don't think you should bash IGN for it, but a lot of people are disliking this video. <laughs> and people are saying, IGN, I'm warning you, if you don't stop with these BS reviews, I'm unsubscribed. <laughs> like, IGN cares. But, anyways, 99% downloading. Let me get my controller, my brothers. It's downloading. Yeah. Do you see the icon up top? Okay. Oh, I forgot you gotta install it. Curse the PS3. I don't know why you have to download a game and then right after install it. <laughs> why can't it just be like Xbox where you download it and it's on? But, anyways. I'm looking at these comments. 8.5 FIGN. I'm unsubscribed. <laughs> oh my god. Um. Okay, so it's 22% installing, you know. You know, I just see that this is the time where we can just, you know, connect closer to each other, you know. Well, what do you guys think about IGN giving this game an 8.5? And uh, GameSpot said that the story was boring really and I'm like really and they said the kills on two stories sucked I'm like was me and GameSpot playing the same kills <laughs> because me personally I thought the story was good I mean it wasn't the greatest story but GameSpot said the story was wasn't one of the best parts of the game and I'm like really but anyways oh, they are just bashing IGN on this video <laughs> One guy said, "Oh, because it's a PS3 exclusive, it gets a it, it get." It, it <laughs> he said, "Oh, because it's not on 360, it gets an 8.5. I guarantee you, if this game was on 360, it get a 10 out of 10. Screw you, IG." <laughs> okay, it's installed. Oh yeah, Fight Night Champion demo. Side kills on three open beta. That's all that matters right now. I do not have a. I gotta get that, a PlayStation Move. I already have the eye camera, so I think all I need is the controller, right? I'm not sure. Leave it in the comments. I don't got a PlayStation Move. Come on, let's pass this. You know, this might be my review right here. I mean, I just might review it while playing. <laughs> no, I'm joking. But uh, I just wanted to show y'all, you know, the startup and everything. Let's pick uh, Espanol. That's what I speak. No, I'm joking. Warning, if you have a history of epilepsy or seizures, consult a doctor. Blood and go, okay. 
please uh, why you gotta do all this for a beta telling me to adjust the brightness anyways I'm gonna play this game and then I'll we'll get to a quick review all right everyone take take your seats this will be my review for the Killzone 3 open open beta oh yeah it's open for everyone my brothers and sisters as long as you got a PS3 I mean it's not open for you if you got an Xbox but anyways um let me just say before I get into this review I love being on the Hellgas team just because of what the guy says when the game starts and you're on the Hellgas team. When you're on the Hellgas team and the game starts, and if it's a team deathmatch, the guy will be like, Slaughter the ISS, come. Like, don't, it, 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 it just feels so evil. <laughs> like, I, when I'm on the Hellgas team, I feel like I'm a bad. I'm like, yo. I mean, just slaughter the ISS scum. I mean, and when you're on the ISA team, I think the ISA guy says like something like, "Kill the enemies." So I'm like, that that's so plain. I mean, would you rather have someone say, "Kill the enemies," or slaughter the ISS scum? <laughs> I just love being on, being on the Hellgas team. But anyways, um, so there's three modes in this beta: Warzone, which is mul multiple game types combined into one game. For example. You got things like Search and Destroy, Team Deathmatch, and Capture the Objective all bunched into one game. And you got Guerrilla Warfare, aka Team Deathmatch. We all know what Team Deathmatch is. And you got Operations, which is basically just Capture the, uh, capture the Objective. That's it. So those are the three game modes. Let me say the bad things I don't like about this beta. Yes, I do. It's just two complaints I got. Just two. So don't go all IGN on me. Don't be like, IGN stands for ignorance. <laughs> but, um, so the only two bad things I have to say about this beta is I'm not sh I'm, I, I, I doubt that it was like this in Killzone 2. I think in Killzone 2, you had to hit the person, I think, two to three times to kill them. And this beta, it is a one-hit beatdown. I don't like that. Because they you you can be full health. If someone hits you one time, you're done. I don't like that. That's like Call of Duty stuff. No, this is kill zone. I don't like that. I hope they can change that in the future. At least make it a two to three hit beatdown. Um And the last thing I don't like about this game is it is only two things. Um aiming down your sights. When you when you press the aim button, well the aim button in this game is the God, I, I, I need my PS3 controller to do... The aim button in this game is the... It's the right... It's the right stick. You press the right stick and then and then you aim down your sights that way. Aiming down your sights... It's always been a problem in kill... Even from kills on one, I don't... I, I've never liked to actually aim in kills on. It just feels so hard. It's, just, it's been like that way since kills on one. It's the same way in this beta. I just find myself blind firing a lot in this game. Like I don't. The only time I aim down my sights if the player is like straight ahead from me. But if he's moving, I hate to aim down my. It, it just feels tough <laughs> to aim down to aim down your sights and hit the guy. So that's another complaint. But that's been like that since kill since kills on one. But hopefully they can work on that a little bit. And let's get to the good things I like about this beta. Um, when you think Killzone, you think what? Graphics, my brothers and sisters. Basically, if there's a Killzone game that comes out, it's guaranteed to have good graphics. So the graphics, of, of course, are great in this game. The controls are, the overall, the controls are way better in this game, way smoother. People did not like Killzone 2 because the controls just felt so unresponsive and so heavy. In this game, it feels way better. You know how in Killzone 2, when you would run and try to turn a corner while running, it would just feel so heavy to do. It's like you would run, but you'd be like, yo, it's so hard to maneuver while running. But in this game, my brother, you can, you can run and like do juice. Like it's so easy to run and turn in this game now. So that's way better. The running in Killzone 2 was so sluggish. I just hate it to run in kill, Killzone 2. And this game, it kind of has that easiness of Call of Duty. Not as easy, but it's still easy. Um, so the running has improved in this game. Just the controls overall. The controls overall are better in this beta. Um, some things I like in this game, you get extra points for double kills, headshots, assassinations, um, first bloods, which is Call of Duty when you 
get the first kill in the game. You get e extra points for doing all that stuff, so that's cool. It lets you know when you're on a kill streak now. I, I just small things like that adds a lot to the game. You know, I got three kills straight, and it said you are on a kill streak, my friend. I'm like, thank you. And yeah, just small things like that add a lot to the game. So that's so that's cool. Um. This another thing I like about this beta so far. This beta, I've played three games so far, and is I played three or four games so far, but this beta is lagless, lacking of the lag, lag free. Like I've played three games, and I, I'm like, yo, there is no lag in, in this game. I think it's because kill. I don't. I'm not sure, but is Killzone Three supposed to have dedicated servers? I'm not sure, but uh, I think they are. But me personally, I think it's necessary if you. For a developer, if you release a shooter, you better have dedicated servers for that shooter. I, I I think that should be a necessary feature if you are releasing a shooter. Because when you're playing a shooting game and it has lag, it really kills the gaming experience. I mean, look at SOCOM. Enough said. I, I actually have a video I'm going to do on SOCOM, but I, 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 I just love playing shooting games that don't have lag. I think shooters mainly need to have dedicated service it'll it, it would add a lot to the gaming experience as a whole and um is that all i got is that all i gotta say is that all i gotta say from this paper i think that's all i have to say overall this beta is cool i just had two complaints about the beta but really this game feels way better than kills on two the beta is fun as heck to play I feel like I can dominate in Killzone 3. Now, I never felt like I could dominate in Killzone 2. I just had no confidence in Killzone 2. Like, if I would get in a gunfight, I'd be like, God dang, I'm, I'm about to lose, and then I would get the kill. In this game, I'm like, oh, you're going to die. And then I kill him. Like, I, I just feel more confident in Killzone 3. So, uh, let's throw the paper away. If you haven't downloaded the Killzone 3 open beta, it's open for everyone. At first, I thought you had to have PlayStation Plus, and there was no way in heck I'm getting PlayStation Plus just to play kills. Listen, I don't. That's a whole nother video. I don't. I don't like play, <laughs> PlayStation Plus. But anyways, the beta is open for everyone as long as you got a PS3. Hope hope you guys enjoyed my review for this game. Um, as always, I greatly appreciate if you guys rate the video. But it doesn't have to be a thumbs up. It could be a thumbs down. Just rate the video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Catch you on my next one, alright? Peace.